Well, the Real Housewives of Orange County are back, and Vicki Gumbelson starting over after a tough last year and plenty of controversy. Yeah, that's right. She's turning the page onto a new chapter and trying to mend some relationships. But will it work? Take a look. Thank you for inviting me. I'm so touched by the story with Terry and the love that you guys have, and I want that for my life, too. And I went about everything probably wrong last year, and I'm sorry. I didn't want to believe what you guys were saying it was true. And I was fighting to hang on to something that was slipping through my fingers. And I want to ask for forgiveness. Forgive me. Oh, and Vicki joins us live. Welcome back, Vicki. Good to see you. I know. Another season, right? I feel another like we're going season. by so fast. I know. Another season. Yeah. This is season 11. Yeah. Last year was a tough year for you with mm -hmm. all the drama that went on with your previous boyfriend, mm -hmm. Brooks, and mm -hmm. kind of the, the medical... Yeah. Uh, there was confusion, confusion yeah. over yeah. his. Yes, let's put it out. Um, so, would we say that this is a fresh start for you? And I think we all can agree that no we've been together. Yeah. Well, we're, no, we haven't been together for almost a year now. But I think we all can agree that we've been in some disastrous relationships in the past. I mean, if you haven't been, then you haven't loved hard. So, yeah. um, I've learned a lot from it, but. I don't know if I'd do it again any differently. I mean, I, I, I believe and I love, and that's how I was raised. Yeah. And, um, but here we are in a new season um, and a new year. I've got my daughter coming back. The viewers are going to see Brianna moving back. Um, the friendships are probably never going to be the same, and I'm okay with it. Okay. I, I really believe that um, there's some room for forgiveness on both sides. Um, some of them are willing to forgive and move on, and others aren't. Mm. And I can't control or change what they want to believe. Yeah. I can only do what I know and what I want it for my future. And right. you know Well it seems like you're happy where things are in your life right I'm now really and what we'll see play out mm -hmm. in this season. But is it true that you after all the drama last year almost didn't sign up for a new season? You know, I address each year as if it's a it's a it's a gift and I have to be prepared for the consequences. The consequences were were these women going to um, be able to move past last year. I mean, yeah. last year was tough on me, yeah. more so than on them. And I was willing to ask for forgiveness because I want to move forward. Um, there was a lot of things that they did wrong and I did wrong and Brooks did wrong and the whole gamut. But I, I don't want to live in the past anymore. Yeah. I mean, we have a rear view mirror for a reason. Like, it's in the past. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And um, I, 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 the viewers will see what happens with a lot of those friendships. Okay. Um, well, that wasn't the only thing you've been dealing with either. You had another big obstacle to really? overcome. You got you had a serious ATV accident. Very serious. So what happened there? And I, you're okay. Yeah, I'm, obviously we're all we're all very blessed and fortunate to be not physically damaged from it. So Tamara was driving. We were in an area called Glamis, and she went up a hill, and I think oh, we that's just the, that's it right there. Oh my just took gosh. a Very bad, bad, bad rollover. So. Um, you know, it was scary. I, yeah. I, I really kind of thought I was dying. I, I really thought I was going to see my mom, and I was okay with it. I thought, okay, if this is what it's like, I'm going to heaven, and I'll get to see my parents, and I raised two great kids and two great grandkids, and all that stuff started going through my mind. Yeah. And then when I realized I was going to be okay, you know, it, it really makes you feel fortunate yes. yeah. for for living and, and having a near-death experience, and, you know, we all became very close through that. Did you have a lot of recovery um, time? It was about four weeks. You know, I had wow. a severe concussion. And oh my gosh. what's interesting is my memory was so off. Like, I couldn't remember anything. And yeah. my doctor said, well, I go, do I have Alzheimer's? Because my dad died of Alzheimer's. It's like, no, you don't have Alzheimer's, but you had a serious concussion. Yeah. It's going to take a while to, to feel 100%. So. Yeah. Well, with new seasons comes yeah. new cast members. Yeah. Let's talk about Kelly, who's Kelly. joining the ranks. How is she, and how are you all getting along? She, yeah, you know what I like about Kelly is she didn't have any preconceived notions about me. She she came on the show just going, like, whoever wants to be my friend, good. And she's very opinionated, which is always good for a new cast <laughs> member. Yeah. Um, but her and I get along great, and we have a great show together. So. It's going right. to be a good season. Well, next time you, you come, we have to tell us about the new love in your life. I know. Next I time. know. But I'm glad you have We'll see one. if he's still there, right? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> All right. No. Well, be sure so, to get the yeah. season premiere of The Real Housewives of Orange County tonight at 9 p.m. on Bravo. Vicki, thank you so much. Thanks for, for having me. Good to see you. Good right. to see you.